which one is this? It's the steel white sales documents. Oh, that sounds pretty exciting to me. I'm going to save the game before I enter and hope that this is not one of those loading screen mini quest things. But we'll see soon enough. Ah, I can actually just go inside the building. So most likely this is going to be easy peasy in and out. Get some documents, leave. Everything's good. Oh, this looks fancy. This looks very fancy. Master Thief Garrett is not used to such fanciness. He's used to, like, pens in secret areas, which are also kind of fancy. I mean, you have to go through some hoops to get your pen in a secret area, I would imagine. I would imagine that costs something. Oh, captain's notes. Winter, 841, Throvian, Maine. Tailwind and calm waters took us around the Throvian seaports. Some of our cargo took ill in the passage across the shoals, heaved them overboard for the mermaids. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah. This is inevitably very interesting to some people. But I, for one, am not really interested in this captain's shenanigans. So, I'm going to leave. Try to find the thing that I came here to get. Hmm. Again, like uh, a lot of these side quest areas, no one here. Everyone's out for the day. Everyone's asleep. Everyone's uh, had a tough day at work. They need a little bit of rest. And uh, that's when I strike. Master Thief Garrett only works in the night and only when people are asleep in rooms that you know, Master Thief Garrett can't actually access and then you don't have to render as many models in your town because they don't actually exist. None of these people exist. That's going to be the plot twist at the end of the game that everyone's actually a robot. And uh, no one existed all along and even if you did kill people, it doesn't matter because they were all machines anyway. They, hadn't had, they didn't have a soul. So uh, that's, that's what I'm going to expect. Everyone was a robot all along and all of these people's fate, fates is pretty irrelevant to anything, really. Because they, uh, they didn't really have anything going on at all. Do I really need a rope arrow to get up there? Because I really don't want to, but... Ah, it does look like it, doesn't it? Rope. <sighs> Goodbye, my only friend. Goodbye, friend rope arrow. We hadn't spent enough time together, and I really can't justify using you for this, but... With the finest routes around the lockdown that bribes can buy. This quarantine has worked out well for the Baron's administration. Well, I pretty much got, like, at least a quarter of a rope arrow back in this little side quest right here, so it was... <sighs> Not worth it at all. It wasn't worth it at all, you guys. But at least we removed the dot from our mini-map. And that's something we can be a little bit proud of. Part of me kind of wishes I could just destroy windows. Like, I, I would just have, like, a hammer. And just crush a window. Wouldn't be stealthy. That terrified me. I was trying to grab that rope. It wouldn't be stealthy, but, you know, it would just... Like, I don't mind just being able to remove that animation from my life. Well... This is a place. Is this actually going to lead me to the place where I want to be? Which is all the way over there. Because uh, I feel like I'm going to need another rope arrow to do that, actually. Because I'll be able to plant over there. I guess, uh... Hmm. Give me that. Would that be necessary? I don't think that would actually get me over there at all. So, that does seem a little bit pointless. So maybe not. Maybe this is just another thing altogether. There's a lot of possibilities, though. This is a strange place to be. Uh, fortunately, everyone's dead. So I don't have to worry about anything that's going on here. F1! Let's view the map. Let's view the map. Uh, there's still a bunch of side quests just in this general area. I'm not sure how to get inside there. There is probably a way. Maybe I just have to walk all the way around. I mean, there is like a rope over there as well. I'm going to jump down here. This place looks pretty safe right now anyway, so... There is always that. Let's grab that gold coin. Another weird little area over there. 
Not too much exciting stuff going on. A coin purse is always nice to have. It's a good thing many people just drop stuff everywhere because otherwise uh, it would be a bit pointless to just run around here, wouldn't it? This, uh, this doesn't really get me anywhere, does it? Well, let's just go inside. There might be something of interest in there. Maybe there's a loading screen in here. There is. Look at that. Loading screen take me to a whole new world. Don't know what this world entails, but... Uh, what is this place? Why does this place have its own... There must be another thing I can go out of here or something. I can't imagine what else there would be here. That was... That was pointless. Open everything. Find nothing. Master Thief Garrett is on the loose once more. Maybe I've been here before. Probably not, but... Huh. This is where I could go back, so... Yeah, this would be a really nice place to have a rope arrow for later. Because I feel like going back there again is going to be a nightmare. Um, well, map, you are just spinning out of control. Uh, I think I'm going to just follow the road first. Do I want to follow the road? It looks like I can't really tell if the white circles are like if these are like the more longer objectives and these are like, the easier ones. Maybe that's what's going on. They do seem to be a slightly different color. This seems to be more of a cyan, but it might just be the background playing tricks on me. I don't know anymore. I think I'm just gonna f go up that staircase right here. Go to that particular white circle first. But I'm worried that this is gonna be another place where I just can't enter at all without some sort of rope arrow. I can see the window. Or at least a glow from the window. Can't did see you the scope it out? God. The Watch City Council building? Stop sure did. screaming like that. Tight, like you guessed. And the Baron's bust? I've already Solid heard that gold. dialogue as well. I actually well, remember that watch. dialogue of all, all things. It doesn't happen very often that I actually remember hearing a dialogue. Usually I'm at least sort of aware that I heard it before, but this time it's like, yeah, I actually just have heard Let that before. Be hang for trying to steal the Baron's bust. Uh... You are not making this easy on me, aren't you? Are you, game? I'm pretty sure I have been up there as well by just going up a different area. I guess I could probably go up here. Don't see me. Just don't even bother. You know you can't kill me. You've tried before. I'm pretty sure I ended up killing you. It's just a mess. Just stop. Just stop. <laughs> It's so pointless what you're trying to do here. Well, here we go. Hmm, this is a strangely placed side quest thing. Fork. Knife. Saucer. That's a very strangely placed side quest thing, actually. What is going on? Right there. What is this? Retrieve Comfort's Necklace. Well, let's actually read the side quest text as well. See if there's anything of interest. Uh, there was one of Comfort Protégé that borrowed the necklace from her a while back. Now she blah, 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 blah. Head over to the skin market and catch up with little Lucy and invite her back for dinner. What? Uh, that sounds... That sounds like work. <laughs> I'm not here to do work. I'm here to win. Why did he randomly stop crouching there and just terrify me with the world there. That was un uncalled for. Can I just fall on your face? I would appreciate that immensely. I would be okay with that. If you moved! Please? Today? Are you just gonna stand there forever? Yes, you are. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, fine. The moment I find a good time to fall down on your face, you are gonna be in trouble, mister. There we go. <laughs> Stealthy. And he slowly slides downwards. Can I pick up something? Yeah, I can. Thank you, sir. That's all I wanted from you. Go away now. Hmm. 
Alright, so how am I gonna deal with this? Is there some way to actually enter this thing? I kind of probably shouldn't have jumped down the way I did. Oh! That works. Lucy? Lucy, are you there? I have an invitation for you. Oh, is that it? That's a pen. That is not an invitation. That is a pen. That is not an invitation. That's a pen. Um, yeah, this, uh, this is a place. I mean, it's nice, I suppose. I feel sort of welcome, and, uh, there is a quest marker in here. Can I climb up this? Nope. There's a lot of booze. Just unnecessarily large amount of booze. Hmm. There's a rope as well. What have you been doing in this place, Lucy? What kind of nasty things have been going on here? I don't know. What I do know is that there is a side quest Blibbity Blop. And it seems to just point nowhere. And I don't appreciate it very much. In fact, I'm kind of just tempted to go continue with the main story because, oh my god, all these side quests are just me looking around a room for a long period of time and then going, Oh, actually, it's over there. Or, oh, I have no idea how to get there. And then just leaving again, so... I actually am tempted to continue with the main story just so... Just so I get some progress here because this is just... This is just silly, isn't it? There is just seemingly nothing here. Maybe maybe using this path right now? Nope. Nope. This, this is not helping me. <laughs> this is not the road to help right here. I can use a rope arrow, which bothers me because it probably means that I actually have to go down... Uh, like to the, the... The floor underneath this. Which is probably what's going on here. Yeah, there is, there is a, there is a thing there. So most likely I'm going to need another rope arrow, and I don't have one. And that's kind of sad, because there is indeed a thing over there. And, yeah, I, uh... I, I'm going to just finish the main quest. I'm just going to beat the main quest. That's going to be the rest of this playthrough. <laughs> screw, the, screw, screw the side quests. They're just not worthwhile. Most of them are just go inside a building, grab a thing, leave forever. Repeat, rinse, wash, clean, five ever, thug life, etc. Like, that's just pretty much every side quest right now. And honestly, and even even the, like, extra areas, have I've just lost interest in them entirely. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make my way back again, which I believe... Oh, look at her. Does she not mind me? I mean, she's doing some weird things with her hands. I guess she's just dancing. Someone animated this. Someone animated this with, with an idea. But I can't really tell what the idea was. If you know what this person's trying to do... Please inform me, because I honestly have no idea. So I'm just going to leave. Leave her alone. Because I'm... I don't want to bother her anymore. I don't think I'm her type. And as such, it would be rude to just stare at her for a long period of time. And I don't wish to be rude, so I'm instead just going to steal from the richest of the rich. Will you just stop? You've tried- I've said this before. You've tried this. It's not working. It's not working out between you and me. You're gonna try to kill me every single time I walk here. And I'm every time- every single time I'm just gonna say no. I don't wish to die this day. This is not my time to die. And I would appreciate it if you would just see that. So we can both move on with our lives and not continuously go into this back and forth fighting circle of unhappiness because I don't think either of us are really happy with the situation we got going on right now and even that guy's a bit un... like a bit perturbed. 
He looks perturbed. He does. And it's just, it's just mean what you're doing. It's mean to the people that work here. It's mean to me. It's mean to your own sanity. You, you're gonna get a burnout. None of us want this. So let's just leave. All right. Um, let's open up our mini map. Let's open up our big map. Let's look at where we're actually supposed to be, which I guess is over here. The Northcrest Manor in Aldale. Uh, I don't know if I can get there from here, but we're going to find out. We're going to find that out today because, yeah, side quests are not exciting to me anymore. <laughs> what is exciting to me is progress. And the sooner I progress through this game, the sooner I can say, yep, I saw what happened. That's just unfortunate. I could have sworn. How do I get through this? There's a lot of stuff going on in here. There's a lot of guards. I don't really want beef with any of them. No beef. No beef for me today. The dawn is coming. The dawn is coming. There to greet it. I don't even know what that means. But I'll go along with it, sir. If it makes you feel better, I'll go along with your silly little shenanigans. I wish I could just climb up there and just punch him. Saying nightmares just be done with it, you know? Like, part of me just wants to, like, do him. Just do him in. Stick him down. Part of me is like, do you know how expensive that is? And that's my Dutch side showing. My cheap side. My pay-for-your-own meal side. Yeah. It's an awful side to some. But it's so such a lovable trait to those familiar with Dutch culture, which is more interesting to talk about than what is going on right now on screen. Like, even these people don't want to be here. Even these people are like, I wish we were just not here. I wish we were elsewhere today. Maybe maybe play bingo. Maybe go on a cruise. God, I would like to be on a cruise right now. I'd be so okay with being on a cruise. like this since the old bear gardens. Animal fights aren't for me. Couldn't stand the crowds. But if Animal the Graven really have a cure for the gloom, stand I'll the crowds. wait through the throngs the that just get it. That was, that was just an impeccable showcase of dialogue right there. Just halfway through the dialogue, just restart the same dialogue and then just end both dialogues at the same time as well. That was, uh, that was art. That was art is what that was. Right, well, I'm here now. Wow. Did you look at that? Spies. There's a lot of angry people in this city tonight. There are. The Baron's a popular man for all the wrong reasons. He seemed nice in the cutscenes, though. I mean, he was helping out friend Erin with her health. Because she looked a bit unhealthy after she fell down into the blue. So, there's that. I mean, you know, he has qualities. It's just that no one really appreciates those particular qualities. <laughs> I was just... Like, part of me is like, I kind of want to do the side quest. But part of me is like... If I could jump, I could. But I can't. So I'm just going to leave. <laughs> uh, I'm just going to go to the to the big the big icon on the map. Save my game. Right here. And uh, continue onwards in this direction. What are these people doing? There we go. I managed to remove the icon from my map. Meaning that I'm making progress. Yes. That's a problem. Yep, that's a problem. Um, hmm. Well, this, uh... This could lead to all sorts of shenanigans. How did he disappear like that? I don't know. What? Are you serious? Ah, uh, well, let's just run. Time to be stealthy. There we go. Ooh, this could be a problem. This could be a very big problem right here. Don't make me look for you. <sighs> I can't even leave. Let's just hope no one looks here. I have a bolt with your name on it. It's a good thing this is not actually a light. Surely you don't need to hide from me. <sighs> Surely. Um, hmm. Well, I'm, I'm at the mansion, so that's good. Where do we actually need to go? 
Looks like I just need to follow the path. That would have been good to know. <laughs> that would have... Uh, like, having that particular goal would have been good to have before I ran into this little alcove here. Well, at least they're both stuck inside that building. Um, you know what? This, this is about as good a time as any to use uh, one of these. That's so unfortunate. Yeah, maybe not. Not this time. I was hoping like the choking arrow would have been kind of cool to use there just because it would probably take care of both of them. But if I could just wait it out and not use anything, I guess that would be even better. So this time you're lucky. <laughs> you're lucky that you gave up because otherwise, oh man, that would have been a nasty sight for everyone to behold. Do I really want to be here though? Uh, I guess I can take out that guy because he's a bit worrying to me. It's not like anything's really stopping me. Well, except for the game. That's actively trying to get me spotted by letting me climb up there. I don't know why the battle music started playing there again, but sure, why not? Uh, I'll just leave him there. I don't think anyone's going to see that. And if they do, it doesn't even really matter, does it? Because, well, for one, I can just hide in there, apparently. I might actually just do that, because I'm curious where this leads. But first... Before I go in there, let's see what else is going on here. I think, like, I think I actually just enjoy this more. To just go and, and explore, like, the main quest areas. Because at least those are areas which we haven't seen before, just at all. And it's just exploring for the fun of exploring. It's not just exploring because a side quest is telling us to go there. It's just, like, we're just going to be thieves and actually just steal whatever's not nailed to the ground. Or to the wall, or whatever that expression is. We're just gonna take stuff and then move along. And I think I think I just enjoy that more, really. It's just more fun to me than continuously following this list of things which I have to do, which really have nothing to do with anything except for Basso, who doesn't really have any input on it either. It's like you do the quest, you don't even return to Basso either. It's like, yeah, I have more stuff to do. That guy terrified me. Is he a vendor? Yeah, he is. Have a look. Interesting. Uh, well, I guess I can buy a rope arrow from this guy. Maybe I'll buy two, actually. Because, you know, I was feeling rich. Now I don't, but I was. Might as well sell my poppies while I'm here as well, because those are all useless. And, uh, yeah, I'll just leave it at that, I think. I'll buy a brawnhead arrow, actually. Why not? I'm pretty sure I, yeah, I still have a whole bunch of water you know arrows. Where to find me. Actually, I didn't know where to find you until now, but I guess you have a point now. Hmm. This place is a bit odd, though. Is there any... Maybe this actually just leads me to where I need to be. Which is pretty sweet. I don't know where this is. Like, uh, you know, we're seeing new things. We're seeing these vents. Large series of vents. Who doesn't love himself a good vent every now and then? I sure love me some vents, especially ones where you can climb up and uh, go to places like this to find a mysterious man hidden in the sewers. And I'm actually exactly where I need to be, so, like, all in all, man, that was, that was about as lucrative as it gets. Except for that guy. The graven are already on the bridge. I won't have a lot of time at Northcrest Manor before they get bored of making trouble here. I'll go there in a second. First, I'm going to go in here, because this seems far more exciting. And I'm probably going to stop playing the moment I enter that particular little area right there. So, uh, unless that actually leads to the next chapter, then I'll just stop before even going through the loading screen. So, let's see what's in here first. Oh, there's a fish. So, whatever happens, we found a fish. And we hit a fish with our club. And we saw our frame rate go in every direction. But, uh, let's see what's... What's going on here? Scissors. Gotta have scissors when you're dealing with this many fish. Uh, definitely worthwhile. Very worthwhile to have golden scissors to uh, fish around with. Well, that was that was definitely worthwhile. I I'm pretty happy I went inside there. Cause that 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 I I love myself some fish and seeing fish and scissors in the same area, pretty much my dream come true right there. So yeah, I'm pretty happy about that. What's this? Chapter 6, a man apart. Well, that's going to be next time. So I hope you enjoyed it so far. And the next time we play, we're actually going to do something. Except about 
Except for whining about side quests, which has pretty much been this part, hasn't it? There's a lot of sparkles there. The sparkle stop over there looks a bit strange. There's this little fire going on over there. I don't really want to go here. Why is everything on fire where I go in this main quest? I don't know. But, uh, yeah. Enjoy this wonderful fire effect. I figured I'd set myself on fire so you can appreciate it a bit more. And, uh, yeah. See you next time. Bye-bye.